You could save thousands on your cat's food, depending on what you're currently feeding. And I took the best of the best in each category and compared it to Jericho's homemade raw meaty bones diet so that I can show you the actual cost of each savings per day and savings per year. And I use the best of the best in each category because I know that you want the best of the best. That's exactly why you're here. I used to spend around $2.66 on Jericho's human grade dehydrated food, then about $3 a day on his complete raw food. And now I spend about $1.52 saving me $540 each year. An additional bonus, the two companies that I used to feed the dehydrated cat food they don't make it anymore. And the raw cat food that was complete, they went out of business, so they don't make cat food anymore. So there's an added bonus <laughs> to feeding homemade cat food. You save money and you can actually have control over the food. Hey friends, it's Jess and Jericho. It is a blessing that you are here, hallelujah. Yeah. So is homemade cat food actually cheaper? Yes, it is because you have control over the ingredients Therefore, you have more control over the cost. It's just like if you were to buy ingredients and prep your own meal at home, it's always going to cost more to dine out, aka have someone else make the food for you, than you make it yourself. Some different ways that you can save on your cat's homemade food, you can look for manager specials, you can shop around at different grocery stores in your area to see who offers the best price per pound. You can talk to your butcher or a local meat shop. You can order specialty cuts. Maybe they might even have extra cuts that they don't typically sell, but they have them. You might even get some for free. You can talk to your farm or farmer's market and maybe you'll find the same deal. I was able to get a bag of giblets, which is heart, liver, and gizzards from my local farm just because I asked. And the whole bag was about six bucks. It was really, really nice. Another option is rewards points. So the two places where I get Jericho's food, Hair Today and Raw Feeding Miami, they both have excellent rewards programs, so I'm able to get free shipping. Sometimes I'm e even able to get all of the food for free. Now it's time for our member shout outs. Thank you so much to all of our supporting members. We appreciate you so much. Just take a look at those beautiful cats. Your monthly contribution helps me continue the work that we do, produce these videos, maintain our online business so that we can help cat parents all around the world feed their cats better. You make all of this possible. If you would like to become a member, put your cat up on the big screen, get exclusive access to bonus content, and support our work, go ahead and pause that join button below this video. There's also a link in the description. Thank you again to all of our supporting members. Now let's get back to the video. Now let's compare the cost of commercial food to a homemade raw meaty bones diet. And I used the best of the best in each category because we all want the best for our cats. I used Jericho's homemade raw diet and he consumes about 200 calories per day. So for all of the commercial foods, I based feeding 200 calories per day for one cat. All of these products made it on Susan Thixton's list. That's why I chose them. And I also have personal experience with these brands. So I know that the ingredients are of human grade quality and I know that they are very transparent about where they source their ingredients. So again, best of the best in each category. For dry food, I chose Open Farm and the cost per day would be $1.77. For wet food, I chose Raised Right. The cost per day would be $6.74. The freeze-dried raw that I chose is Quest Cat Food and the cost per day would be $6.75. For ground raw, I chose Viva Raw and the cost per day would be $2.41. And again, for the homemade raw meaty bones, I chose Jericho's diet. The cost is $1.52. So you could spend more or less depending on what you're feeding your cat and where you're buying your ingredients. Obviously from state to state, from store to store, from online retailer to online retailer, these costs are, can be all over the place. But for Jericho's diet, lots of variety, minimal supplements, I'm spending $1.52 per day, which is less than all of the options that I talked about. Now let's take a look at the savings per year. So for dry food, you would be spending $646.05 per year. For wet food, $2,460.10. For freeze-dried raw, $2,463.75. For ground raw, $879.65. And for homemade raw, what I spend for Jericho is $554.80 per year. So if you're coming from the best of the best wet food and freeze-dried raw, you're gonna be saving 
thousands of dollars. But even going from the best of the best dry food or the best of the best ground raw food, you're still going to be saving a couple hundred dollars per year. So now you might be wondering, well, is homemade cat food worth all the work? Now I know I can spend less money, but what about spending more time? You can check out this video right over Meow where I go over my favorite benefits of feeding a homemade raw meaty bones diet on top of saving money and having complete control over Jericho's diet. Thanks for watching.